Welcome back team forever, back to another video. I'm back with another watch wrestling with me video and we got a good one today. Today I'm watching my first ever Fatal 4 way I think I'm watching on watch wrestling with me. It is AR Fox versus Austin Theory versus Darby Allen versus Joey Janela. Let's play it right now because it's a long video. It's from Evolve. Evolve 111. I love Evolve. I mean, I haven't watched uh, I actually never watched, <laughs> this is going to contradict what I just said, but I've seen Evolve in person a few times, I think like three, four times, I think, and I loved it. I've never actually seen a full show, um, video, a show, I don't, but I just, I just love, based on what I've seen of the four shows, I love Evolve, and some, they have so many people that came from Evolve, I mean, I know they also came from other places in the indies, but I mean, Evolve, oh my god, is this? I recognize that venue. <laughs> Was this in Michigan? Ah, oh, there are my boys. I always see. This is definitely in Michigan. Every time I go to Evolve, they are there and I love it. I love all of them. But they always lose. That's something. They always lose. AR Fox's crew, they're all, and I call them like AR Fox and this gang or whatever. They're all nice. And this is definitely in Detroit. I recognize that venue. They always have this entrance. This has to be recent then. My first Evolve show was, I think, in 2019. No way, because that's last year. So, 2018, like late 2018. So, this has to be in 2018, like early 2018, I'm thinking. Does this say that? I got to see when this was, when this came out. 2020? What? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I didn't know they were nice on Michigan this year and I missed it. Hold on. What? No way. And they had this match and I missed it? No way. I refuse to believe it. I refuse to believe that this happened. I was reading that on the screen, but there's no way this is from 2020. No way. If I miss this show, I am so mad. No, no, no way. Because March, everything was shut down, right? Oh, my God. Did this actually happen and I missed it? I might as well just get out my feelings because it's over with, so... No matter. But did this really happen in March? I'm really scratching my head. Oh, okay. Woo! All right. All right. I calmed down. There's no way this happened in March. Because Austin Theory was inside WWE. So, there's no way that happened. I just put that together in my head. He He's in WWE. There's no way this happened in 2020. But I do remember, she looked like Paige right there. But I do remember that there was an Evolve show I was supposed to go to this year. And because of the pandemic, it got canceled. At least I really hope it got canceled and I didn't miss it. I love, okay, so AR Fox, I like a lot. Um, Leon Ruff, I love. And congratulations to him because he... He done been on Raw, Smack, he ran, he ran the gauntlet in WWE. He was on Raw, SmackDown, NXT, Main Event, and something else. I forget what else it was. Raw, SmackDown, NXT, Main Event. Maybe that's all four. Just all four of those. I might be missing the show. WWE got so many shows. 205 Live. There you go. He was on like five shows. It, was that even it? I don't know if that's true. But, and the other guy, I forget his name, but I love him too. And I mean, the manager, she's cool. I like her. She used to um, manage um, AR Fox. It's really funny. The manager of AR Fox and his gang, she manages them. And she comes out like, hey, all this crap. And she dressed like kind of like a hooker or whatever. She's actually married to AR Fox in real life. And I think on screen they married. And she come out in all this, like, these, like, clothes, like a, I don't want to say a hooker, but she, she dressed more not PG, however you would call it. Um, 
She wear like tight dresses and tight outfits and all that. But then she also manages Aja Pereira, who's also she is the WWE rest, referee now in NXT, the, the referee in NXT, the woman ref. Um, but when she managed Aja, when this lady would manage Aja, she came out in like a business suit and her hair would be done like, and she would, I think she carried a clipboard. And it was like, it was her business side. And then she would come out in the same show. She would come out inside the business suit for Aja and then come out like this with them going, hey, hey, hey acting all ratchet and stuff. So I just, I don't know. I just like it. You can just tell how excited I am about this match because the, we're five minutes into this, I don't even feel like it. Three way. Where's Darby Allen? Is it a surprise? Or did he get taken out for the match? Because I was talking a lot. I hope he's about to come out as a surprise entry. Oh, Joey Janela got a title too? Come on, I really want Darby Allen. Charlie, I'm rough. This is too many managers, though. I'll, they should go back to the back. It's already a fatal foot, well, a triple threat. And he's got like five managers. Get rid of them. And the crowd is already close. Um, Priscilla Kelly do look a lot like Paige. Not because of the skin and the dark hair. Or not just because of that. Austin Theory was the man when I went to those shows too, and of all. But like, I noticed Austin Theory before he was in WWE. <laughs> you no know, people love to say that about people. I just became a fan of Joey Janela. Like all what WWE what AEW's been going on, I thought that Joey Janela and Kip Sabian were the most bland people in AEW. Like I just don't pay attention to them, nothing. But like I actually like Joey Janela. I became a fan of his inside the casino ladder match at Double or Nothing. Um, I think he really, really shined in that in that match, and I really became a fan of his. And now I actually pay attention to him. The bad boy, Joey Janela. Oh, and Joey's with that girl. So does that mean? Isn't that girl with with Kip Sabian now? I might have this mixed up. Here we go. Here we go. Oh yeah, this is old. He looked different. How old is this? Wait, is he not scheduled? Oh, it's for Joey's. Oh, it's for Joey's title. Is Joey a face? Person I dis I like the least in this match. 
Like, I freaking love Darby Allen. AR, well, I don't know. AR Foxes. Uh, it's like, in AR Foxes group, he's the person I like the least. But I, I like him, but I don't know. Every time I watch Aid or Evolve, AR Fox gets his butt kicked. He gets beat up so much when I'm there live. One time he even lost like twice in one night. He lost fair and square, then called out the person for another match later on that night, which was like unsanctioned or a street fight or something. And he lost that too. This might not be in Detroit. It might just be another arena that looks a lot like this. That looks a lot like the one in Detroit. Maybe the, all the arenas are bingo halls that look like this. Actually, yeah. I don't think this is Detroit no more. Because that chandelier is in the middle of the ring. Inside Detroit, it'd be like to... I'm trying to look at details. Jesus, that's why I like Joey Janela. That was a perfect suicide. Oh, oh. No, no. I thought he was shocked like me. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm so mad I missed this Evolve show. I don't care if this came out before I started watching. That dive from Darby Allen was out cold though. All three of those dives were like perfect. I think AR Foxes was the safest. Oh my god. What? Oh no. What the heck is going on in this bed? Oh. What the heck? This is, this is the best. This might be the best Evolve match I've ever seen. If we like a minute into this. What the heck? Another dive! <laughs> oh my god. This is insane. Nobody suggested for me to do this video. I just saw the names in it. And I was like, I gotta react to this. Oh, this is in Detroit because I recognize that girl. I reckon she is at every single Evolve show. And if you're watching this, I recognize you every single time I go to. Well, now that I'm thinking, like, everything in my mind is like, well, it could not be Detroit. Because when I was inside Evolve, the person I was sitting next to, oh, pump kick. I was talking to them. Oh, holy. Holy. And in Ring of Honor, too. Like, people travel for wrestling shows, so. She could be from Cleveland or something, and maybe this is in Cleveland. I don't know. But I think that was perfect. Come on, this match is perfect. Austin Theory coming through with a deadlift. Oh my God! This is a match that I would show a wrestling, a fan that was not a fan of wrestling. This is insane. This is the future. Holy crap, I just said that crap out loud. Like, well, I don't, I don't know how old AR Fox is, but. This is. This is great. Alright, match slowing down a little bit. Slowing down, which is still good. It's due for this. Freaking, who's the star of this match so far? I would say Joey Janela, maybe. Holy crap, that was insane. That was awesome. Austin Theory and AR Fox. He just picked them up just...
Another dive. That was probably the slowest dive. One, two. Holy crap. Two. Darby Allen really looked like a like 17 year old or something. Holy crap. How do you. Oh my god. What the heck, Darby Allen? Super kick. Darby Allen is going crazy. Oh, sunset flip. I wouldn't have been mad if that was the finish. Like, this match probably been going on for five minutes, but it, it feel like freaking. I don't even want to check the time. because My prediction is that Joey Janela will win because it's the safe bet to go with the champion. Um... It's crazy to go with the safe bet in a fatal four way to go for it. Holy crap, what is he about to do? Oh my god. Oh. Alright. I know Austin Theory was champion before when I went to the show, and I think this is like right before I started going to Evolve shows. So my prediction. It, I would think it would be hmm. I don't think it's Darby Allen. That was my last pick is Darby Allen. I feel like it's probably gonna be the champion. What is about to happen? How can he do that when there's fans? I'm gonna go with Joey Janela, but my second choice is Austin Theory. And who I want to win, I would probably want. I just feel like there's no way Darby Allen won this. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna say I will want Austin Theory to win just because it's surprising. Oh my god! That's it! Oh, I would have finished it there. This match has been such fast speed that nobody can be mad at that. What the? She didn't even do nothing. Is Priscilla Kelly? Is she the one that's dating Will Ospreay, or is that somebody else? It's probably somebody else. Dang. What is she? Hold on. What is she about to do? How can they just do that in their fan? I didn't even know she wrestled, to be honest. I really didn't. Oh, Cutter! Oh, oh. Oh, that's why Joey or Darby Allen looks so weird. Because in the, they said that he was in the second match of the night, so he probably sweated off some of his face paint. That's why it looks so weird. Jeez. Uh, what's it called? Judas Effect. He's he just tossing Darby out. Darby Allen weighs nothing. So that, Oh, no sell. Oh, with the stun. <laughs> Great sell. Oh, discus. I don't know what Joey Janela's finisher is. It should have been that pop package power driver he did. So what is he about to do? Oh, my God. God, Meteora. That was the best Meteora I've ever oh! oh, This match is insane. This is going to be one of my favorite matches I've ever seen in my life. Holy crap. That was contrived, but I mean, I liked it. This might be one of the best. This is. I think this is my favorite Fatal 4 way I've ever seen in my life. I can't even think of what what would be. This is amazing. All right, they have a big rival. I think Austin Theory won this match because he was champion when I went. Ooh, oh, holy crap! Oh my God, did maybe Ar Fox did win? Oh. That's what I like. 
That is what I like because I did not see that coming. I did not see that coming. I feel like y'all watching this was in my head this whole match because everything I thought I said. He won a title, right? Was this not a title match? Oh, I thought it was a title match. Liam Gray. Was this a title match or was it? And I don't think it was because he didn't take. Oh, it's not like that no more either. They put a little, a little, or do they? I think they put a little cage, a little fence around us, the crowd. This is insane. Ah, uh, but I kind of wish that the ending would have just been let AR Fox win and that's it. I don't like after match angles when the match was that good. Oh, so it wasn't a title match. Okay, that that was amazing. Hold on, what does that say? Sign up now and get one month free. I might just sign up. That was amazing. I know I keep saying it, but that was... Okay. Y'all just watched with me the best Fatal 4-Way I've ever seen in my life and my favorite Evolve match I've ever seen in my life. That was um, absolutely amazing. That was fantastic. Loved it. Every single thing about it. I would say Joey Janela was the star of the match, but so was Darby Allen. So was freaking AR Fox. He did amazing. Austin Theory, they all did amazing. That was one of the best matches I've ever seen. That was so much fun. I freaking love that. I cannot say it any more good about that match. That was amazing. Oh, that was great. <laughs> Comment down below your favorite um, Fatal 4-Way match or your favorite Evolve match. And comment more matches for me to watch with y'all and watch wrestling with me. Until next time, y'all, leave the video a like, comment, subscribe, share it on all forms of social media. And until next time, catch you later.